Hey, what's up you guys? This is Ice Purple Oz here, and I'm back again with some My Sweet Roomies. And I'm about 77%. 77 point seven. Okay. Oh, maybe tomorrow we get to see some restuses. Oh, tomorrow's the last day. Oh, okay. Oh, hey, I got a silver ticket. Alright, that's good. Alright, let's continue on with the story. Maybe we could finish most of it tonight. Because, I mean, that quick slide was only 0.7%. Even around the house, Mitsuka kept avoiding me an unhappy look on her face. Aki had noticed this, of course, but, but I've got no idea why. As I hesitate not knowing how to answer, Aki presses even harder. If you don't tell me, you'll be sorry. Uh... Well, well, what? Ready for her anger, I go to answer. I, I, I don't know. Huh? I don't know what's wrong with Mitsuka, and I'd like to know myself, in fact. Well, what? It's true. She said that all men are the same. I've got no idea what she meant. Just then, Aki's expression suddenly changes. So we're at 77.7. Let's see how much of, a, of an advancement that was. 78.4, what the fuck? I'm sorry, Bailey, I did- Aki? Aki looks surprised when I say this. Then, she looks at me with slightly downcast eyes. Mitsuka said that? Huh? She said that all men are the same? Y yeah, I see. For a moment, Aki looks down at the floor sadly. Seeing her reaction, a thought suddenly occurs to me. Da does she? Aki, do you know something about Mitsuka? Aki hesitates for a moment, and then, yes, I do. I understand why she's been so unhappy now, too. Well, why? Then a pointed look in her eyes, she suddenly looks straight at me. It's because you're here. Huh? So, point four? Point one, Jesus Christ. We've done two, and we've gone up two percent. Be because I'm here. What, what do you mean? Her completely unexpected reply leave, makes me real with shock. You, don't, you know what's wrong with Matsuka, don't you, Aki? Aki stares down at the floor, though, a troubled look on her face. What if I do? So then, I want you to tell me. If I've hurt Matsuka, I want to apologize to her. I want to know what it is that's troubling her. With everything that has happened, my mind was in a mess. I know one thing for certain, though. I wanted to help Matsuka. A long silence fell between the two of us. Aki, why won't you tell me then? If Aki can't bring herself to tell you, then shall I? Huh? All of a sudden, someone else walks into my room. M -m Miss Aki? So I don't think we're gonna get finished. Miss Aki walks straight into my room. M Miss Aki? Sorry, the door was open. I heard everything you were saying. Oh. I gulp. D -d do you know what's wrong with Mitsuka as well, Misaki? Yes, I do. Please, tell me what it is. I stare at Misaki with a look of desperation. Misaki looks at me with a serious expression. Knowing that night might not help at all, you know? But even if I tell you, Oz, what makes you think you could somehow help Mitsuka? She's right. It may not be something I can do nothing about. But I still want to know. I want to help Mitsuka. I stare at Misaki with an earnest expression. She pauses for a moment, thinking, Alright. I'll tell you what's troubling. What it is that's troubling Mitsuka loss. Finally! Misaki looks out of the window, taking a deep breath. Then she turns to me once more. Well, first of all, there's a, there's a reason why Mitsuka, Mitsuka's uncomfortable around men, huh? Oh yeah, Aoi said that she wasn't good with men before, so there's some sort of reason behind it. Was did you know that Mitsuka's parents got divorced? Oh yes, Mitsuka told me. I see. Do you know why they got divorced then? Huh? Why they got divorced? No, no I don't. I see. Misaki looks down at the floor sadly. Mitsuka's parents got divorced because her father had an affair. 
Well, what do you fucking know? I already predicted that. It's a fucking cliche. Huh? To be continued. <sighs> then I use another silver ticket. Alright. An affair? Misaki books gives a little nod before continuing. Even though he did have an affair, her dad was a really gentle man. And even when her mom accused him of having an affair, he apologized to say to her, saying he was sorry he hurt her. That's what I did pretty much. He bowed his head, promising that there's nothing going on with the woman. Nothing happened with Aoi. That's what he said too. Huh? He said there wasn't anything going on with her. I fucking knew it. So, when she said he, she was talking about her dad? Mitsuka wanted to believe her dad. He is so kind, and she never thought that he'd have an affair. She trusted him with all her heart. But, but, right after that, Mitsuka saw, she saw definite proof that her dad was having an affair. Oh, God. She said she's. She said she him walking. <laughs> she said she him walking. She said she him walking arm in arm with another woman and even kissing her. What the fuck? Huh? To be continued? Oh. At that moment, all the trust she had for her dad must have been shattered. When I think about the pain Mitsuka must have gone through my heartaches to be continued. After that, Mitsuka never trusted her dad again. Even though he'd always been so kind to her. Then, when mo her mom asked Mitsuka what was wrong, she told her. And then her parents got divorced. To be continued. 82. Okay, we've gone up 5%. Closer to 4. But I think that was a really touching episode. Well, it would be if it wasn't so fucking cliche. But... You know...